Hi, I'm Steve and I'm building the world's first blockchain based sporting league. You can follow me as I build one of these 10k avatar projects from scratch and every week I update you on my progress. So along the way I wanted to create a lot of lessons so from pure beginner to the advanced NFT user. The first lesson this week was meant to be all about setting up your MetaMask and getting it funded, a really simple video. But today we had one of the most hyped NFT drops in the last couple of months, the Vugu. And of course it was a complete failure. Um, no one could mint from the website and they've pushed it back to launch tomorrow. So I was able to mint because I've learned how to mint directly from the contract. And that's what today's video is all about. So let's head to the computer. So this morning the Vugu team went live and they sent everyone to their mint page, um, which isn't working now, of course. People were able to connect their wallet, but it didn't really work. There was an issue with MetaMask connection. So therefore all they saw was a page no mint at all um, but one thing they did give was the contract and that shows up on etherscan and as you can see here they've already got 130 eth um 283 000 uh, from the ones that they minted what we can see is every single transaction so 1.39309 was 17 of them uh, these are still pending actually but these ones have gone through so this is when they stop the contract. Uh, if we go into the actual token, you can see that 1,766 Vugus have been minted. There are 409 owners now, um, and there's been 2,580 transfers because people are selling the ones that they got on OpenSea. You can also um, look at a few other things. Who are the majority holders? So. This guy has 81. Um, I'm down here at 17 somewhere. I managed to mint them. Uh, this guy's got 77, 68, so on. There's a lot of other stuff you can see, um, really good stuff. But the thing we want to do is when the website doesn't work or is overloaded, there are a number of reasons why it's not always best to mint from the website, uh, especially with something like this that had tens of thousands of people probably trying to get in. So how did I do it? I came to this contract page and then I clicked on contract, write contract. Now, everything we do on Ethereum uh, is up to you. Things stuff up all the time. Um, so only do this if you are very confident, but you connect to Web3, which is your MetaMask wallet. So let's connect there. This gives you a warning saying it's in beta, could stuff up, you could lose whatever ETH you have in your wallet. It's always up to you in this space. So I'm gonna say, okay. Now, what you need to do is, this is the contract. So it's got all the programming in it. You have to look for something that says Mint. So here's Mint Vugu. All right, now, Mint Vugu, the payable amount, I wanted to mint 17. That was the max that you could do in one transaction. So that worked out to 1.309 ETH as each Vugu is 0 0.077 ETH. Then you put the number you want to mint. So it was 17 for me. Now, if you wanted to mint one, you would just put one. And then in here, you'd put 0 0.077. If you get this wrong, it just won't work. So let's say I wanted to mint my 17. Okay, so we've put that in. If the contract was live, we would then click write. This will open up your MetaMask. As you can see, um, I can confirm, but it wouldn't go through. What I would do next is of course go to edit, click on fast, and then go to advanced because even at this gas price, which would cost me $1,420 to mint, it might not mint in time and you might pay this and get no Vugus. So I'll go to advanced. For the mint, I put in 500, which was a massive amount. It cost me over one ETH to mint my 17 Vugus. Normally I do about two and a half times. So 
let's see what this was. If we go edit, fast, advanced, 46. So I would go 100. And then it will say gas price is excessive, but that's fine. Save. And then it tells me it will be 1.309 to mint, and that would go to the Vugu team. And then my gas fee will be 1.42, which is $3,087. And your total amount is 2.73. So to mint 17 Vugus would probably cost me close to 6,000 US dollars. Confirm. And then, of course, it would go and try to mint them. You can, of course, if it doesn't mint within a minute, I would go and speed up the transaction on MetaMask. Um, but that's it. That's a simple video on how to write from the contract. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe. Follow me on Twitter, and I'll put the link below. We've got a Discord set up. Um, and yeah, I'm going to teach you all about the NFT space. I'm creating my own NFT product. And it'll be great to have you along for the ride. I'll see you next time.